Hey guys, uh, yeah, I am here with, well, you can see who I'm with, JB Gill from Down on the Farm. A uh, real pleasure to have you uh, on the show. Thank you so much for joining me. Well, thanks for having me. Uh, now, t first of all, tell me, how did you end up doing Down on the Farm? Um, well, I think at the time, the development team at, the, the, at CBBS, the BBC, um, saw that I was doing bits and pieces in farming and I you know, made a bit of a song and dance about wanting to go into the, the sector and wanting to work in the industry. Um, and they just approached me and said, you know, would you, would you consider doing the show that we've developed? Um, and at the time I was start, starting a family, I'll say, so I was just about to get married and then obviously went on to, to um, have a son. Uh, and so I, I was very, very in, incredibly passionate about getting that message across to young people and it's still something that I'm very, very passionate about today. Now, older people will probably know him from JLS. He was on The X Factor. I know. It seems so long ago now. It's crazy. I know. Um, but uh, you, you actually run your own farm. Yeah, absolutely, yeah. That's uh, just amazing. I mean, <laughs> I, see, I would love to work on a farm. I know a lot of you guys would like to work on a farm as well. But I know a lot of young people are thinking, oh, I don't know, is it, is it really the career for me? You would recommend it, yeah? Yeah, absolutely. I mean, make no bones about it. It's a difficult industry, you know, difficult to go into farming but it's not difficult to get the opportunity anymore you know and that's one of the reasons why um, I wanted to be the spokesperson for the Farm the Future campaign alongside Barclays um, you know as a, as, a, as a bank they've been helping farmers and working within the sector for over 270 years so they're well placed to, to know some of the challenges that come with farming you know and they're still in there they're still hanging in uh, and giving people lots of opportunities financially um, but at the same time you know for me it's it, you're battling with elements and lots of different things that people consider as you know really, really difficult to kind of obstacles to overcome but at the same time there's so many incredible rewards you know for me from a life, lifestyle perspective I'm able to spend more time with my family I'm able to be at home more which obviously in, in my previous career with JLS you know it was few and far between you know you miss out absolutely everything and so for me as a you know with the young family uh, I really appreciate being around more and being able to take my, my children to school and even have them on the farm working working with me you know it's not easy to do when you're on the stage with, with three other guys so um, you know for me uh, there are so many different perks and the perks far, far outweigh uh, uh, the negatives and, and yeah I love it. So do your kids then do they they look like they're gonna go into farming or do they look like they're gonna go into showbiz? Um, I'm not sure. Uh, I know Ace loves being on the farm and uh, he always wants to get on the tractor and he likes anything that moves to be honest so whether it's a tractor or you know, we don't have a quad bike, but any sort of machinery, he's just fascinated by. So, I don't know, maybe we've got a future uh, farm engineer. Uh, it, it, nice. Budding farm engineer, who knows? Um, but, you know, for me, ultimately, it's it's the experience and the understanding and the knowledge of where their food comes from. That's the most important thing. And, you know, it, some of the statistics that, that, that Barclays have, have, have been able to, to gather, you know, show that 3% of the 18 to 30 demographic uh, are considering a, a career in farming or agriculture, which is just way too low, mm. you know, and, and it's not to say that we want that, that percentage to go up to 100%, of course not, but, you know, we want to, it's got to be higher than 3%, and we've got to be, I think if everyone has an appreciation and understanding for the industry and for farming and the work that goes into it, you know, you'll have a greater appreciation for sustainability, greater appreciation for the food that you eat, you know, we'll think about and, and, and access our food in a completely different way and ultimately that's but that's good for our society but it's also good for the industry as well there you go you see now if jb has uh, encouraged you to take up farming then why don't you put it in the comments uh, just below uh, before we do go we've got the frantic five are you ready to take this on <laughs> yes five <laughs> very quick fire questions for you jb Gill, the time starts now what's your favorite animal pig how many eggs are in two dozen 24. <laughs> What's a male cow called? Uh, bull. Correct. Uh, what planet is also the name of a muddy substance? Mars. Earth. <laughs> Silly. <laughs> and what's the best animal impression you can do? <laughs> it's a crossbreed cow and pig. <laughs> <laughs> Not quite. See, I, I'm from Wales, so I can do the sheep really well. Go on, then. Ready for this. <laughs> Good it's all right, right, isn't it? That's pretty good. <laughs> uh, real pleasure to talk to you. Hey, listen, uh, just before we do go, I, c I can't uh, not ask you about X Factor. Final coming up this weekend. Have you watched any of it? I have watched it, yeah. 
You've done better than me, then. <laughs> <laughs> I had a friend in it, to be fair, Shan. Okay. And she left last week, so I was a bit gutted for her. But, uh, but yeah, I mean, the show's, the show's brilliant. And I think every year, you know, I always try and tune in. You know, sometimes I'm not able to watch it all. But, um, you know, I think it's a brilliant show. And obviously, it's a show that gave me the start and my, the boys the start in, in our career musically. So, um, so, yeah. And, in fact, it's been the foundation of my farming career as well. So. Absolutely. Who's your prediction then to win? <sighs> What's the young girl? Who was in you know in Simon's category? Charlotte. Yes, I think yes, I think so. She, I think she's gonna win. I think you might be right. See, not only is he a great farmer, but he's also <laughs> an astute mind at knowing a good pop star as well. Uh, JP, real pleasure. Thank, Thank you. you very much. Uh, guys, if you do want to check out any more about getting into farming, uh, JB will tell you a brilliant website address and we'll also put it uh, just below as well. JB, what is it? Well, it's barclays.co.uk slash agriculture. There you go. Thanks. We'll see you again soon. Bye.